Tan Han, Tan Han, Tan Han, Param Puri Ka Sate Sadguru, Vahe Guru, Siri Guru, Arjan Dev Sahib Ji, Tan Han. Can anybody tell me what was yesterday? Very, very important day yesterday. Anji? Yes, it was the Jyoti Jyoti Vasavtan Guru Gobind Singh Sahib Ji. That means that the physical, the light in the physical um, body of Tan Guru Gobind Singh Sahib Ji merged with the formless light of Akalpur Kuvai Puri Ji. So Guru Sahib Ji had left their physical body and they had gone to Sachkhand. So that was the day yesterday was the Jyoti Jyoti of Tan Siri Guru Gobind Singh Sahib Ji Maharaj. So Khasa Ji, when we go through the Sakhi today, I want you guys to um, remember, um, we're going to be talking about the events before Guru Gobind Singh Sahib Ji's um, Jyoti Jyot. And today we're going to be doing something a little bit different. I'm going to request everyone to actually make a mental representation of everything we talk about today. Make like a mental image, paint like a picture in your head of everything that we're going to be um, thinking about. So make like a little uh, mental a visual, a visualization of what we're talking about today, okay? So Khalsa Ji, um, Tan Guru Gobind Singh Sahib Ji is um, seated in a beautiful divan where they're giving their beautiful darshan to all the Sangat, right? And right beside Guru Sahib Ji is a Na Tanka Tanuk, a green colored Na Tanka Tanuk, right? And it takes Na Marpar to use that Tanuk, to use that bow and arrow that we just take in the world, we, we, a bow and arrow everybody knows, right? No man par basically means, so to understand how much weight that really is, one man is 25 kilograms, right? And that bow and arrow took no man par, which means 9 times 25 is 225 kilograms. That is how much force that Guru Sahib had to apply with their one hand to push back 225 kilograms and actually to use that tanuk, right? So it's a lot of force and a lot of strength required to use that tanuk. Not a normal, a regular person could not use it. You have to be really, really, really strong. And in the Dawan, there was a, a Umrah, there was a, a nobleman, you can say. And he actually, I actually questioned, he had a question, he said, Is this the Nukh? Ike will darshan vaste ya? Kya ehe e vartya bhi janda ya? Right? Can we, or is it used as well? Is it just for darshan or do we use this the Nukh as well? When Guru Sahib Ji heard this, they went into extreme biras. Right? They got into their warrior spirit, they got up, they picked up the Tanakh very, very fast with great speed. And with great speed, there was all the loving Gursukhs around Guru Sahib. They said that, Guru Sahib, you have a wound, please do not use this, um, do not try to, don't use the Tanakh, right? Because it takes a lot of uh, power to use it, right? Um, then Guru Sahib actually, um, they had a wound because Aurangzeb had actually sent two uh, assassins to um, make Guru Sahib Shri Shaheed. But Guru Sahib actually had a wound from that um, attempt of theirs, right? So Guru Sahib, when they were using that Tanakh, right, they sh shot the, fa the, the arrows with great, great speed, right? And all the people that were saying, made those comments before, now they're saying, Tan, Tan Satguru, uh, Gobind Singh Sahib Ji, Tan Satguru Sahib Ji, Tan Satguru Sahib Ji. They were amazed with the power and the strength of Guru Sahib Ji and the Pratap of Guru Sahib Ji. When the Gursikhs then saw that the wound that Guru Sahib Ji had, there was actually blood flowing from it now. So you can just imagine how much like sadness and virag the Sangat had when they saw that the, the wound of Guru Sahib Ji is now, um, there's blood coming out of it. Right? Guru Sahib Ji then had said to the Sangat, the Sakhal the Shobhakaraj, the great task that I have been sent onto this world to do has now been complete and now it is time for me to, um, to wear my kalabana to go to Sachkhand, to leave this physical body. The Sangat was extremely, extremely sad. They could not um, they, they cannot bear the fact that Guru Sahib Ji could, is going to be leaving their physical body now. And Guru Sahib Ji took five sings and they made them, they, did the, they said the hukam to stand by Tabia. Tabia is the area right there by Guru Sahib Ji. Guru Gan Sahib Ji and five sings um, stood there. And Tan Guru Gobind Singh Sahib Ji then gave the Gurta Gadi officially to Tan Tan Siri Guru, Gran Sahib Ji Maharaj. And if everybody knows, on Wednesday, it was the um, Gurta Gadi Divas of Tan Siri Guru Gan Sahib Ji. That was the day. The Guru Gobind Singh Sahib Ji gave Gurta Gaddi to Tan Tan Siri Guru, Gran Sahib Ji Maharaj. Right? Now, um, Khalsa Ji, Guru Sahib Ji, Guru Gobind Singh Sahib Ji Maharaj, before, um, they, um, before their Jyoti Jyot, they gave very, very precious bhajan to their Guru Sikhs of how they, sh they should stay after Guru Sahib leaves their physical body. And these are some bhajans that they gave. They said, always make sure that you remember Vahiru Guru Mantra with each and every breath of your, of, of, that you take. So imagine that we always, every single breath we take, we always have to remember Vahiru Guru Mantar. 
ਵਿੱਚ ਗੁਰਬਾਣੀ ਗੁਰ ਸ਼ਬਦ ਦਾ ਅਭਿਆਸ ਬਹੁਤ ਹੀ ਪਿਆਰ ਸੰ ਪਿਆਰ ਨਾਲ ਕਰਨਾ ਵੈਰੀ ਵੈਰੀ ਲਵ ਮੇਕ ਸ਼ੂਰ ਦੈਟ ਯੂ ਡੂ ਗੁਰਬਾਣੀ ਗੁਰ ਸ਼ਬਦ ਦਾ ਅਭਿਆਸ ਆਲਵੇਸ ਮੇਕ ਸ਼ੂਰ ਦੈਟ ਯੂ ਨੈਵਰ ਨੈਵਰ ਡੂ ਈਗੋ ਨੈਵਰ ਹੈਵ ਈਗੋ ਇਨ ਯਰ ਮਾਈਂਡ ਆਲਵੇਸ ਆਲਵੇਸ ਮੇਕ ਸ਼ੂਰ ਦੈਟ ਯੂ ਲਿਵ ਅਕੋਰਡਿੰਗ ਟੂ ਦਾ ਗੁਰੂ ਖਾਲਸਾ ਪੰਥ ਰਾਈਟ ਗੁਰੂ ਪੰਥ ਦੇ ਆਗਿਆ ਨਾਲ ਚੱਲਣਾ ਹੈ ਰਕਾਸਤ ਜੀ ਦਾ ਸੰਗਤ ਉਸ ਵੈਰੀ ਵੈਰੀ ਸਾਡ ਦੇ ਕਨਾ ਬੇਅਰ ਟੂ ਬੀ ਸੈਪਰੇਟਡ ਫਰਮ ਦੇਅਰ ਗੁਰੂ ਫਰਮ ਫਰਮ ਤਨ ਗੁਰੂ ਗੰਸ ਸਾਹਿਬ ਆਫ ਤਨ ਤਨ ਸ੍ਰੀ ਗੁਰੂ ਗੋਬਿੰਦ ਸਿੰਘ ਸਾਹਿਬ ਜੀ ਮਹਾਰਾਜ ਵਨ ਗੁਰੂ ਸਾਹਿਬ ਜੀ ਵਾਸ ਲੁਕਿੰਗ ਅਰਾਉਂਡ ਦੇ ਸਾ ਦੈਟ ਹਾਊ ਮਚ ਇਨ ਫੈਕਟ ਦਾ ਸੰਗਤ ਇਸ ਕ੍ਰਾਈਂਗ ਐਂਡ ਹਾਊ ਮਚ ਬੈਰਾਗ ਦੇ ਆਰ ਡੂਇੰਗ ਐਂਡ ਐਟ ਦਿਸ ਟਾਈਮ ਗੁਰੂ ਗੋਬਿੰਦ ਸਿੰਘ ਸਾਹਿਬ ਜੀ ਸਰਵ ਖਾਲਸਾ ਜੀ ਉਹ ਪਿਆਰੇ ਖਾਲਸਾ ਜੀ ਰਾਈਟ ਦੀਸ ਫਿਜ਼ੀਕਲ ਬੋਡੀਜ਼ ਆਰ ਮੈਂਟ ਟੂ ਕਮ ਐਂਡ ਗੋ ਦੇ ਕਮ ਐਂਡ ਦੇ ਗੋ ਦੈਟ ਇਸ ਦਾ ਵਿਲ ਦੈਟ ਇਸ ਦਾ ਵਿਲ ਆਫ ਤਨ ਗੁਰੂ 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 ਸਾਹਿਬ ਜੀ ਰਾਈਟ so do not cry and in fact make sure that you always stay steadfast in your rahat always stay steadfast steadfast in your good sikhi and always do good bani um shabad abhyas and in this way i will forever ever be by right by your side whoever does this whoever remembers guru sahib ji does guru bani ji abhyas and stays steadfast in the rahat guru gobind singh sahib ji they will feel that they're right beside them right so khasa ji from this asakhi today we learn that how strong how fearless and loving and caring guru gobind singh sahib ji or guru sahib ji is right and how much they made how many sacrifices they made throughout their life they sacrificed their entire family for us right at the age of 9 very very young age they um guru tegh bahadur maharaj ji guru gobind singh sahib ji maharaj um just father um were, were shaheed right and then their four sahib zade mata gujar kaur ji right many many pyare pyare gur sikh gur singh singhaniya right they all were shaheed right guru sahib ji sacrificed them for us they gave tan tan sri guru granth sahib ji gurgaddi gurgaddi for us right so guru gobind singh sahib ji is a memo their their pratap and their praise cannot be said so khalsa ji it's really important for us that we listen to guru gobind singh sahib ji's bachan that they gave to us and we always remember them and in fact when we come to guru mukhi class we are actually listening to their bachan we are we are trying our best to learn the gurbani ji that they had um they have blessed us when we go from um the akhar class all the way to maharani all the way to the um gurbani classes the santhya classes we are in fact are um we're going by there we are living their their hukum so it's really important that not only from sunday classes but even outside of sunday classes um gurmukhi classes we try to uh, live according to guru gobind singh sahib's vachan as much as we can and we try to live and we try to get their happiness and what will happen as a result tan guru gobind singh sahib you will feel are right beside us you always feel their presence um near us Okay, Khalsa ji. So we are going to be um answering a few a couple questions or we're going to um just so that you hopefully you guys remember. Um we're going to ask a couple questions and then we're going to go to Pankti job. So does anyone remember how much weight you require to push back like that from one from the guru side needed with in their one arm to push back? How much weight was that? How many kilograms? Anji. 225 kilograms with one hand. Anji. And what happened to Guru Sahib's wound as a result when they used the 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 tunak? Yes, there was blood coming on. How did the Guru Sahib react? How did they react? They were very very sad. And ji, and how many sins were standing in Guru Sahib's tabia when Guru Sahib ji gave gurta gaddi to Guru Granth Sahib ji Maharaj? And ji, five um five or six and ji five sins. They were sad. And can anyone give me one bachan of Tan Guru Gobind Singh Sahib ji that they gave? the go six to the uh, sangat before they um went to the teacher anji to to learn to do the to learn to learn art and learn anji to learn gurbani ji with love right you are first sir anji reincarnation right they're not they're not consigned to that they don't come and go they're always here with me forever and ever and ever even though guru um gan sa tan guru gobind singh sahib ji had left their physical body that does not mean that we are separated from them we can always get their darshan through gurbani ji we can always get their darshan through um their guru six and sangat guru prasad oh abinasi parakho hai abinasi abinasi means 
Nasturahat all means Nasturahat, right? So Maharaj is they never they're never um, destroyed. They never they're always um, with us. And we can see Guru Sahib Ji's jodh in every single one of um, one of us. Maharaj's jodh is in our in our heart, in every one of us. So we can try to see Maharaj's jodh um, prevailing through all of us. Good for some. Ji ka khalsa, Ji ki fateh. So let's sing this. I want everybody to sing along, okay? Sate Goro Mira Sada Sada Sate Goro Mira Sada Sada Sate Goro Mira Sada Sada Please visit gurusevak.com.